What's up guys, got the Serpent 411 out. Started, keep an eye on that. All right. Had a little mishap, see it reading? All right, had a little mishap with the rock this morning. It was a big old rock like that size. Smacked right into the front of it and bent it all up. It's the one bad thing about this car. It sits so low to the ground as you can see. It's pretty low. But she's so fun to drive. So I just did an 8S run with my Mugen MGT7. And uh, took one of the 4S's out of there and put it in here. Just kind of see what it would do on 4S. Never ran it on 4S, so. And I didn't want to put a fully charged 4S in there because I don't know if this motor that's in here can handle it. First time I'm using one of these motors also. It's made by uh, Racer's Edge. I think it's a 4800 kV. 4500 kV, sorry. Turn down my dual rate. All right. Yeah, 4500 kV for, uh, all right, and then a 4S flow pack in there. Ran it on 3S a couple times, no issues, but 4S, I've never tried it, so hopefully it holds up. It's like a 550 can, but never really, I know they sell like uh, tools for RC and stuff, but never mess with their ESCs or motors or anything like that, so. <laughs> oh shit, right into the fucking bush. That was awesome. <laughs> I should have got out of it. My dumb ass, well, I'll just stay in it and see what happens. I could have guessed what was going to happen. Got caught on that bush or rag or something. Where did it even go? Oh, it's in this tree over here. Well... There's my receiver. There's the Mamba Monster 2. There's the servo. Well, definitely didn't hold up. That's it for that car, I guess. Let's see, there's my fan. Oh, well, that's no good anyways. Oh, damn, there's the LiPo way over there. It chucked it, man. Oh, yeah. You don't smell sweet. That was crazy. That car's totaled. Whew. I got a tire under here. Oh, there's all the axle and everything. And then tie rod, one of the fins. Man, we're just picking up pieces every day. It's like a field or everywhere. It's like a field day for parts. There's another fan. Oh. Hell yeah. There's just shit everywhere. Is the GPS still in the car? Nope, GPS is gone too. That's the one thing I do have to find. Oh yeah, it totally broke the chassis in half. So, I do have to find the GPS though guys. That and the battery is, was my main priority. So, oh, there's a shock. There's a shock there. This car's totaled, man. I ain't gonna rebuild it either. It's toast. If it launched the battery way over there, then the GPS could be way over here too. Man, she was getting it too, guys. She was getting it. I just want to find the GPS. 
find the GPS, I'm happy. Car, eh, I can fix or throw it away, use electronics on something else. I guess that racer's edge though, it handled it fine. Handled 4S, so that's a good thing. Now I know I can put it in another car and it'll take it all day. And I was just running an old Mamba Monster 2 anyways. I didn't even like look at it to see if it's thrashed or, or what. I wonder where the hell the GPS is. There's just so many rocks, dude. I gotta get rid of all these rocks. I just don't have the patience or urge to walk through the street picking it all up, guys. I just don't look at this. This is something like it hit earlier. Might be the same one. It'd be nice to find that GPS though, that's for sure. Because I need it for the rest of the day or else I'm finished though. Take my glass off, maybe it flew over the fence. Might have to go get something to hop that fence. I always uh, take this tape that comes off the car, put it on the trees, so I know if I'm missing a part when I get home, I know where to come back and look for it. So that tape right there is the same kind of tape that was holding on the GPS right there this thin stuff so it might be over here there's another piece of that thin stuff GPS has to be over here somewhere then has to and it's chilly out here today If the GNSS even survived, there's a piece of tape there. If it even survived, I can reuse it for the rest of the day on other cars. If it didn't, I'm done for the day. There's that piece of tape there that was holding on the GNSS. So, it's gotta be over here somewhere. Like I said, it might have flew. Might have flew a poop over the fence. 